But like we were like we were saying earlier about the internet and the downloads and all that shit, I was talking to a guy on FM, and for the first time ever, they're having to report the iTunes shit, the downloads from iTunes now instead of the, just FM broadcast what goes out. Yeah. Anything that takes cash has to be now they log. have to tally all the iTunes yeah. because the iTunes has surpassed CD sales. Yeah, by, oh yeah, by far. Yeah, it's so. a it's a it's a crazy industry. It's changing all the time, man. So you got to stay on top of it. But the one thing that won't change ever is if a band wants to make it, they got to be on the road well, building that right, fan base. Cause yeah, the fan the, base the is what, is what you. helps you survive, man. I mean, you know, they buy your T-shirts, they buy your CDs, they, that puts gas money. And so you keep going down the road and and hopefully accomplish that dream. You know, one day of, of making money at it. You know what I mean? Right. I mean, that's the goal. It's it's a lot of fun. But this is a job, you know. Well, we're doing stuff that we love. Each one of those towns can get a get a true piece of you when they see you live. Yeah, well, that's know? what we so. aim to get, man. You know, I mean, you got to do that. You got to go out there and you give everything you have, so you build that fan base. Um, you know, that's what you have to do if you want to so, make it. I, I know way. you've been doing this for a minute. What what made you decide to do it in the first place? I know you went from football injuries, a lot of good shit or whatever. <laughs> good <laughs> shit. Yeah, it, yeah. It, it, impact, whatever right, you want right. to call that, to just this creative side that uh well i've always had it i've always been uh, into music i always played music uh during my football career uh, played in bands i was in side bands i was i played drums in a death metal band out of arizona when i was rehabbing my back injury out there uh, how, do you re- how do you rehab a back injury and play death metal fucker? <laughs> i was all in, in <laughs> my, all my training oh, all my, no 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 seriously check it out more for you, bitch. <laughs> no check it out all my training because i had sir back surgery and then i had to recover the whole deal so i'm, I'm rehabbing my back injury and uh everything because of the back injury shifted to core strength and so whereas before when we were growing up you know playing ball and this and that everything was power lifting Right. And was, but and no attention was really paid to core, you know. Right. So uh, you know, it's not just a matter of, of having abs. It's how strong are those abs? Can yeah. you do punch pull ups? Can you do a bunch of you know body movement things that are going to keep you safe from injury? Most so re- recovering my back injury, uh, I was playing drums in my death metal band, and I would sit as my drum chair on one of those therapeutic balls. Yeah. Yeah, and I would drum doing that. Come on Come through, on through hey, man. Hey. Mr. Brad Cummings. Hey. There he is, right there. Hey, he's coming yes. through. Yeah. Mr. Brad, Brad Cummings. Cummings is coming through. Coming on down. <laughs> That's got to be the craziest shit to rehab. I sit by the drum kit yeah. on one of them balls, one of them therapeutic ball, balls, because it you, makes you fire you, your yeah. core. It makes you, you know, because you can't it relax because you, you always got to be moving. And I, and I, and I was, man, That's double bass. Awesome, that was awesome, man. There you go, dude. Now I got a challenge for you. You yeah. always go working out and shit and fucking doing shit. You can fucking draw your name on a piece of rice. Yeah. Go sit on the ball and fucking play death metal drums. Well, I can't play death metal drums. You can't play shit. But I can stand on the poster ball with keep one a, foot. Keep, try to keep a beat and 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 drum it. Uh, keep a beat and sit on a uh, one of those uh, therapeutic balls at the same time. Here's what I'll tell you. You know what a poster ball is? Yep. Yeah. I'm on one side, round right. on the other. Those are easy. I, I can put my foot. These balls. Are. I can put one foot in the middle of that fucking. I mean, that's easy. Stand there. <laughs> And do a kick, and then put my leg behind me with my hands. Well, aren't you fucking Ralph Macchio? I, 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 I understand but, but, that, but it's all core. I understand that's, that. That's, that's pretty talented. Has nothing to do with legs. Dude, don't fucking <laughs> fuck <laughs> fucking Ralph Macchio up anymore. This motherfucker. Hey. He'll talk the biggest pile of shit, but don't know nothing about trading. That's the best thing about this. Hey, anyways, fucking. It's good that you you do about trading. Fucking. I, yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. We still love you though. Oh, well, I don't care. You come trading with me anytime. No you know problem. That. Now that we're doing this thing again. Yeah. We might be able no to do problem. that. Well, I've been, hey man, I've been into music. That's that, that's where we got off. The, I, I've been into music. Uh, music has been a big part of my life always, and it was just a natural progression for me. Done with awesome. football, man. When I was in football, I was putting on benefit concerts and getting on stage. Uh, they did a thing one year, uh, Monday night at the mic. I got to play on stage with Three Doors Down. I was playing wow. guitar with them. Um, you know, awesome. yeah, I, I I've been on stage with Pantera before. You know, I mean, it, 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 it it's been uh, I've been on stage with Down, uh, playing guitar, and uh, yeah, I've had Good. great you got a lot the of with the pink beard. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah. yeah, man. No, Don was a great friend of mine, man. Uh, uh, rest in peace, man. He was a great friend of ours too. Yes, still is. Don't fucking anybody ever forget and, that. Uh, forget about the mayhem monster. That's right. Yeah. 
Well, Kyle, why don't you give out your website and your Facebook, whatever, and we'll fucking turn this thing off and All right, cool, do man. what we do. That's yeah. right, that's right. That's <laughs> well, it, that's in the rut, as we began the rut, just as nutty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so come on, come on, man. Oh, man, go to uh, gridironrecords.com. Um, and uh, that can take you to everything. Once you go to gridironrecords.com, everything is up on the front page there from Facebook to Twitter to Reverb Nation. Uh, we just hit number 12 on Hot Country uh, 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 in uh, Reverb Nation, uh, which is a great website for anybody to look up killer bands that are out there doing stuff. And, um, you know, we're, uh, we're out there on everything from iTunes. We're, we're, we're still in the top 200 country right. bands in iTunes right now. And, Moving our way up, we got a new single release coming December 14th, so stay tuned. Go to gridironrecords.com for all your needs. Well, right now, everybody that fucking loves Kyle Turley, you'll be seeing this shit on YouTube, on Kyle Turley Link, on DemonSeed.biz. In the rut, man, we're back for the fucking... Well, before we completely leave, hold uh -oh. up. Uh -oh. Is there anything that you'd like to say to the World Wide Web out there? <laughs> Just get it off your chest, let the people know. I mean... Is there just something that no man, one, I don't if, know, if man. no one knew you and you had to sum up something just like that, redneck style, just quick and simple, what would it be? It would be turly, turlified, you know what I'm saying? I know what it would I just, be. I just I tell people, posts. nah, man, you know, I, I'll tell you what it is, man. It's uh, what you thought you knew, you don't know. So come nice. out to see a show and uh, nice. I like that. I'll show it to you. It, you know, this thing is real. It, uh, I've been doing this for a long time, and uh, it, it, this is not this is not like what other people have done before. This is no joke. This is some real shit. And uh, you want to see a great show? Come out to mine. We put it on for you, and um, we got plenty more coming. There you go. That ain't no bullshit. Straight from the horse's mouth. Kyle Turley. In the rut, 2010, bitches. One more time, bringing it to you, video style. Now you can see the grubs <laughs> with our boy Kyle Turley. We know it's not death metal, but hey, we're bringing it to you anyway. New stuff, World Wide Web. Watch your balls. Honky New, Rock. New Year's Eve. Honky Rock, that's it. That's Honky Rock. New Year's Eve, the Rail Club, Fear Factory, and Demon Seed. Don't be scared. That's right, that's right. Hey, December 3rd, one more time, Dallas, Texas. December 3rd, Hat Tricks. Hat Tricks, one Come more on time, out. Kyle Turley, bring your ass. Yes. We're done. <laughs>